And the big night has arrived. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the UEFA Europa League final. My name is Derek Ray. My co-commentator to help describe all the action is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time here. It's Arsenal up against Sporting. Well, Derek, this has everything, doesn't it? Two good teams, some top-class players and a couple of excellent coaches. What a final this should be. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Aaron Ramsdale is the goalkeeper. Granit Xhaka plays alongside Martin Odegaard in central midfield. And the main striker here is Edward Nketiah. Here's the lineup for Sporting. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five. But with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. It is the Europa League final, and they are underway. Nketiah. He successfully got past him. And his teammate got him out of trouble. Palinha. Martin Odegaard. Lokonga. It's with Erdogan. Went in strongly, decisively. A lovely first touch. That wasn't easy. Well, possession seeded. Granit Xhaka. Nketiah. Saka. Nketiah. Keeper not concentrating. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Martin Odegaard. And now they have the ball back. Nketiah. Oh, his eyes lit up, thinking it was about to be the opener. Well, just the lack of composure. He should score there. Zuhair Fedal, Mateus Reis, Palinha. What can Sporting do from this position? And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. 
Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. for the goalkeeper a foul but no whistle instead advantage with Arsenal intercepting it intelligently White Beautifully weighted ball. Promising sequence. Cedric. And Ketia. Can he finish? Terrific block. Well, there you have it. They haven't been good enough going forward. They've created very little so far. They need to play with much more urgency. Read it well. Veering in field here. A bit sloppy in possession. Can they create something from here? A glorious chance. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? <laughs> well, a short corner here be on for them played into the box struggling to get it away Xhaka this looks promising oh a goal to put Arsenal in front on this massive occasion and how significant could that be in the grand scheme of things here well here it is again and if you are going to clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. And they don't do that. It's a poor clearance. And suddenly, the ball's in the back of the net. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. The quest for Europa League success and the second half of this final is underway. Well, moving the ball impressively here. And unable to hang on to the ball. That's good pressing for you. Ben White. Here's Cedric. Martin Odegaard. 
and a strong tackle. Palinha. Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. We can get more details on that injury situation from our man pitch side, Jeff Shreves. Jeff? Word from the bench is that he's actually twisted his knee. That's why he's been trying it out. At the moment, he's carrying on. Cheers, Jeff. Well, putting it wide from there, disappointing. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Nuno Tavares. Jacker with it. Very comfortable when in possession. Can he put it in? And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Second goal for them here. Bukayo Saka. Granite Jacka. You can sense the threat is there. And teammates to play it to. Danger averted for now, but they have a corner to defend. Going short. Now shot happy here. So following the deflection, a corner kick coming up here. And deciding to go short with this one. And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result. couldn't keep the ball well as you can see Arsenal have had most of the ball and as a result have dominated the game some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch and I don't think anything's going to change that now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence making progress and pull back well that's gone out and it is going to be a goal kick So make 
making the substitution now. Ten minutes to go then. Coates. Mateus Reis. Well, this game ebbing away and Arsenal have been brilliant, Stuart. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. And they'll be happy to have regained possession. Martin Odegaard. Lokonga. Elneny with it. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. A danger here as he runs at them. It's a neat move. On to Lacazette. Lokonga. Cedric. Now with Lacazette. Oh, closed down straight away. And there's the whistle. This UEFA Europa League final has been decided. And my goodness, they deserve it. Disappointment on one side, but sheer jubilation on the other. Well, relief and joy, I would say. What a great achievement this is. And so well deserved, as you mentioned. They were excellent tonight. What a good performance that was. The party can certainly start now. That's a party to last throughout the year, I should think. They're very happy to be celebrating good times in the Europa League. And now the trophy awaits them. Well, these are always great moments for any player. This is the culmination of a great tournament they've had. They fully deserve this victory. Every player played his part tonight. This is what they've wanted. Now it's in their possession. The winners of the UEFA Europa League. Well, wonderful scenes. The players are making the most of this. It's been a great competition for them. And I think they have every intention of making this last as long as possible. One more trophy left. Why not? Yes. And now they get to enjoy the moment with the fans who have made the journey here for the final. Well, they'll be loving this. They really have backed their team throughout this competition. They have a great bond with the players, don't they? That's lovely to see. Yes, it is all about a shared experience. These celebrations will run long into the night. Well, they need to take all this in, don't they? These are moments to savour. It's been a great night for everybody involved. You are looking at the UEFA Europa League winners.